one by using suitable scales, draw and label the following vectors. So A, X, Y represent 5 Newton of force to the right. So here X, Y, 5 Newton of force to the right. So to the right, so this one is X starting to Y. So direction to the right, this one is 5 Newton. But you see here, this one is using scales. So, what is the suitable scale for this one? So, you can use 1 cm for 1 newton. Or you can see, or 1 cm represents 1 newton, where this one you draw 5. So, B, RS represents 40 km displacement to the southwest. So, basically, southwest is this way. So, this one, this way, where this one is R to S. So, this one is 40 km displacement to the southwest. southwest. So, the suitable scales is 1 cm represent. So, 1 cm represents 10 km, right? So, that you just have to draw 4 cm. So, this one you just draw 5 cm. Okay. So C, so vector V represent velocity of 20 km to the west. So C to the west, this direction, this one is V. Just now we have X, Y, right? We can label X and Y. But this one we only have V, so towards the left direction. Because like we know that this one is north, south, west, east. So west is to the left. So this one is V. So this one is 20 km per hour to the west. So, if we use 1 cm for 10 km, the length will be too small for you. So, suitable scales would be 1 cm represent, represent, so divide by 4, we get 5 km per hour. Okay, so that you just have to draw 4 cm from this one to this one, 4 cm. Because this one is 5, 5 times 4, so we get 20. Okay, so now for the A, vector A represent momentum of 7 kg to the left. So now we are going to the left, same direction this one. So vector A to the left, so this one is A. So 7 kg to the left. So here, 7 kg, so 7 cm will be quite long. So you can use, uh, so you can draw 3.5 cm. So if you use 3.5 cm, so we can say that 1 cm represents 2 kg meter per second. So this is how you draw it. You choose a suitable scale which is like a suitable line. You can see this one is 3 cm. Like to draw a line of 3 cm, 4 cm is